It's been shown for many years actually that epidural spinal stimulation in combination with motor training facilitates recovery in complete spinal cord injury in animals. This NIBIB project demonstrates for the first time that epidural spinal stimulation also works in humans with complete spinal cord injury. Now this is very exciting. Uh, the significance of the results that we will be reporting is that we found a new avenue to, uh, to apply to individuals with very severe spinal cord injury that will help them to improve their motor function. That is, they will be able to stand and to step and be able to improve perhaps their voluntary control based on our initial results. We've known for some time that the spinal cord has a pretty sophisticated neural networks within it. Well, what we're doing here is using epidural stimulation to increase the excitability of this network. But a very important point, and what's really different here, is we're not actually stimulating at an intensity that will induce the movement. We're just modulating the background activity of this network. We've been able to achieve a level of function that has not been demonstrated before uh, in an individual with a motor complete injury. That is, this individual can stand for several minutes uh, independently. Now, several minutes may not sound like a big deal, but several minutes of standing for an individual that has not stood for several years is, is, is quite important.